Some Texas police chiefs came out today against a new proposed piece of state legislation. This legislation would basically allow adults 21 and over to carry handguns without having to get a license and going through training first. The legislation is being championed by many Texas Republicans. Political reporter Jack Fink, though, is looking at both sides of what is nothing short of a hot button debate. Keep firearms in the At a news conference on the steps of the Texas Capitol, police chiefs, including Eddie Garcia of Dallas, took aim at a House bill that would make it easier for adults to carry handguns in public and end the requirements to be licensed, trained, and pass a written and shooting proficiency test. Those convicted of felonies and domestic violence would not be eligible. Gun owners have a duty to ensure that their firearms are handled safely and a duty to know applicable laws. The licensing process is the best way to ensure this message is conveyed. Supporters of what's called constitutional carry, such as the chair of the Texas Republican Party, retired Lieutenant Colonel Alan West, say Texans can already carry long guns in public without a permit, and that passing a federal background check should be all that's required. I think that every single person that comes in here to buy a firearm wants to get properly trained on it. But that does not mean that their right to have that firearm and to carry that firearm should be infringed. Texas Democrats have opposed the bills and instead have filed legislation that would increase gun restrictions. Police chiefs say boaters need to obtain an education certificate and barbers must have a license. And that now, when violent crime is rising, is not the time to loosen gun laws. At least with the license to carry permit, citizens must demonstrate basic knowledge and an awareness of the laws. And the course now even teaches how to de-escalate to forego the use of the firearm to begin with. Westo says the background check system needs to be accurate. I think what these police chiefs should be talking about is making sure that the NICS system, it doesn't fail us anymore. House Bill 1911 was approved by a committee and now heads to the full House. Similar bills in the Senate have been referred to committees. In Grapevine, Jack Fink, CBS 11 News.